When the Transcontinental Railroad was completed in 1869, it established an infrastructure connecting the East and West for the first time in American history. And it was this infrastructure that brought a new era of prosperity to the United States. Today, we're standing on the verge of another revolution, this time in space. The Jupiter spacecraft is Lockheed Martin's International Space Station cargo resupply solution, but resupply is just one of its potentials. Using the commercial resupply program as a blueprint for this new space age, the Jupiter spacecraft can rendezvous, refuel, reorbit, and service a wide range of existing and future spacecraft. It's built with the best of the best, already in place today. Architecture that is safe, reliable, and affordable. Jupiter's robotic arm is the latest generation of technology that's been in service on the International Space Station and Space Shuttle for more than 30 years. The Exoliner container is based on the proven ATV cargo carrier, and it will launch on the Atlas V rocket, which has a track record of more than 50 successful launches in a row. And it's all built on a spacecraft design that's currently orbiting Mars. Just like a rail car on the Transcontinental Railroad, Jupiter's Exoliner can do many jobs and reach many destinations. Supplying the International Space Station, transporting raw materials and cargo to deep space, or providing a habitat for interplanetary journeys. Jupiter's flexibility is unmatched. Lockheed Martin is committed to NASA's exploration goals. That's why we're proposing a cargo resupply system that not only reliably resupplies the International Space Station, it also advances us farther into space than ever before.